Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're making homemade peppermint hand scrub. This is a great gift for the holiday season, but it's also something that's nice to just keep by your kitchen sink for when your dry winter hands could use some exfoliating. This is a very easy recipe and you could easily double it or triple it or quadruple it and give it as gifts. So for one pint of this, for one serving size, so to speak, you'll need a cup of sugar, a half a cup of coconut oil melted, two teaspoons of jojoba oil or rosehip oil or almond oil, that's optional, it's up to you, eight to 10 drops of peppermint essential oil and eight to 10 peppermints. So I have more than that in that peppermint bowl just for the aesthetic of it, but you only need eight or 10 of them. So this recipe could totally be adapted to your taste. You could add olive oil instead of coconut oil or add a little bit of both, whatever you would want would be great. So I'll link the recipe that inspired this below, but like I said, it's definitely the kind of thing that you can tweak. Additionally, you will obviously need something to put the sugar scrub in. So these are pint-sized mason jars. I like them because they have a wide mouth, so it makes it really easy for someone to dip their hands in or dip like a wooden spoon or something like that in if they wanna grab some of the scrub out and wash their hands with it. So the first thing we're gonna do is grind up these peppermints in the food processor, and from there, we will start mixing the ingredients together. I have my food processor out, and so I'm gonna go ahead and take, it's, the recipe calls for about eight to 10 peppermints. That's 10, I'm gonna go ahead and add about 15 because I want it to have that really nice kind of reddish pinky color of peppermint. So there we go. Now we're going to cover the top and I'm just gonna pulverize this into dust. So the next step, of course, is to mix all of the ingredients together. So I'm going to go ahead and move this food processor, which suctions to the counter, so it's a little hard to do, and pull the top off. So here you can see what the inside looks like. It just becomes fine, fine peppermint ground up, clearly, <laughs> but you couldn't have guessed that since it just went through a food processor. So I'm going to go ahead and get that all out and into my white bowl. Perfect, the next thing I'm gonna do is add in the white sugar. So I have the white sugar and the peppermint. You can see it makes this really pretty, really pretty color. And now for the wet ingredients. So I'm gonna add half a cup of melted coconut oil. two teaspoons of jojoba oil, and then the recipe calls for eight to 10 drops of peppermint. Um, I feel like I'm gonna use about six because this is Young Living Oils and it's really strong and I don't feel like I need quite that much, so I'm gonna do six. There we go. You can always adjust this if you like scrubs to be a little bit of a drier consistency or a little bit of a wetter consistency, you could do that. If you want it to have a stronger peppermint flavor, you could do that. Or scent, I should say, although this is edible, I would not eat it. It looks quite good. I do want it to be a little bit more wet, like I don't like how it's so clumpy. I do want it to have a little bit more oil in it. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my jojoba oil and add maybe another teaspoon or so. That looks perfect. It smells so fresh and amazing and it looks absolutely gorgeous. Let me see if I can adjust the color a little bit so you can see the color. It's this lovely bright holiday pink color and it's just so great. So I'm gonna go ahead and pop this recipe, this batch into one of my pint sized jars. So there we have some really, really festive and super easy 
peppermint hand scrub. So I'm gonna go ahead and package this up the way I would package it up if I were giving it as a gift. But that recipe that I just showed you almost fits one of these perfectly. So you could add a little more if you wanted it to be filled right to the top. But just know that you'll need to, if you wanna make four of these, you'll need to quadruple the recipe. You know, if you wanna make two of them, you'll need to double the recipe and so on. So here it is all packaged up with a big candy cane ribbon on it. It is such a cute gift. This would be great for coworkers, teachers, friends, family, extended family, girlfriends, you know, whomever in your life could use a little bit of hand scrub. You could use it as body scrub as well, but I think this is so nice to keep by your kitchen sink, like I said, and use as hand scrub during these dry winter months. It's easy. You can totally make a quadruple batch and give it out to four people. Anyway, this is my recipe for this little easy DIY peppermint hand scrub. This is a great gift idea this year. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I would appreciate a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment below if you make it.